Hey there, are you tired of dealing with broken teeth? Well, fear not, because in this video, we're going to show you how to prevent teeth from breaking and what to do if it's already broken. We'll give you easy to follow tips and tricks to keep your teeth healthy and strong so you can smile with confidence. Whether you're dealing with decay, trauma, grinding, or weakened enamel, we've got you covered. And don't worry, we'll keep it engaging and fun, because let's face it, nobody wants a boring dental lecture. So get ready to learn and let's dive into the world of teeth. First, we'll talk about some of the essential vitamins for teeth and give you some examples of foods that are rich in these nutrients. Vitamin D, the sunshine vitamin. One of the most important vitamins for teeth is vitamin D. This nutrient helps your body absorb calcium, which is crucial for building strong teeth and bones. Vitamin D is also important for keeping your gums healthy and preventing tooth decay. The best source of vitamin D is sunlight, but you can also get this nutrient from foods such as fatty fish, eggs, and fortified dairy products like milk and yogurt. If you're not getting enough vitamin D from your diet or sunlight, you may need to take a supplement. Vitamin C, the immune booster. Vitamin C is another essential nutrient for healthy teeth and gums. This vitamin helps boost your immune system, which can help prevent gum disease and other oral health problems. Vitamin C also plays a role in collagen production, which is important for maintaining strong teeth and gums. You can find vitamin C in a wide range of fruits and vegetables, including citrus fruits, berries, kiwi, bell peppers, broccoli, and spinach. Aim to eat at least five servings of fruits and vegetables each day to ensure you're getting enough vitamin C and other important nutrients. Vitamin A, the tooth enamel protector. Vitamin A is important for maintaining healthy tooth enamel, which is the hard outer layer that protects your teeth from decay. This nutrient also helps keep your gums healthy and promotes saliva production, which is important for washing away bacteria and food particles. You can get vitamin A from foods such as liver, sweet potatoes, carrots, spinach, and kale. Just be careful not to consume too much vitamin A, as excessive amounts can be toxic. Calcium, the building block of teeth. Calcium is a mineral that is essential for building strong teeth and bones. This nutrient makes up the majority of your tooth enamel and is important for maintaining the structure and strength of your teeth. Good sources of calcium include dairy products like milk, cheese, and yogurt as well as leafy greens like kale, collard greens, and spinach. If you're not getting enough calcium from your diet, you may need to take a supplement. Phosphorus, the calcium sidekick. Phosphorus is another mineral that is important for maintaining strong teeth and bones. This nutrient works closely with calcium to build and repair tooth enamel and promote healthy bone growth. Good sources of phosphorus include fish, poultry, meat, beans, and nuts. Most people get enough phosphorus in their diet, so supplements are usually not necessary. Now that we've covered the vitamins essential for healthy teeth, let's talk about some foods that can actually cause teeth to break. Breaking a tooth can be a traumatic experience, and it's something that nobody wants to go through. While accidents do happen, there are ways to minimize the risk of damage to your teeth. One of the main causes of broken teeth is hard or tough foods. It's important to know which foods are more likely to cause damage so that you can avoid them or take steps to reduce the risk. If you're a fan of hard candies, popcorn, or chewing ice, you might want to reconsider. These are some of the biggest culprits when it comes to broken teeth. Other foods to watch out for include nuts, hard bread crusts, and crunchy fruits and vegetables like apples and carrots. However, we understand that avoiding these delicious foods can be difficult. If you can't resist, there are some strategies you can use to make them safer for your teeth. One way is to break these foods into smaller, more manageable pieces before eating. This will reduce the amount of force needed to bite down and can help prevent tooth fractures. So next time you're munching on some popcorn, try breaking it into smaller pieces before eating. Another way to avoid breaking teeth is to cook foods in a way that makes them easier to chew. For example, you can roast vegetables until they're soft and tender, or you can steam them to make them more pliable. You can also boil tougher cuts of meat for a longer period of time to make them more tender and easier to chew. These cooking techniques can make hard or tough foods more enjoyable to eat without the risk of breaking a tooth. 
In addition to these strategies, it's important to maintain good oral hygiene habits to keep your teeth healthy and strong. Regular brushing and flossing can help prevent tooth decay and gum disease, which can weaken your teeth and make them more susceptible to damage. And if you do experience a broken tooth, don't panic. Follow the steps outlined earlier and make sure to see your dentist as soon as possible. With proper care and attention, your broken tooth can be repaired and you can get back to enjoying your favorite foods once again. If your tooth is broken, it can be a painful and stressful experience. But don't panic. There are steps you can take to protect yourself and ensure the best possible outcome. The first thing to do is rinse your mouth with warm water. This will not only help to soothe the area, but also remove any debris or dirt that may have entered the broken tooth. You want to make sure you're in the best possible position to defend yourself against any further attack. Once you've rinsed your mouth, it's time to fortify your position. Apply a cold compress or ice pack to your cheek or jaw near the broken tooth. This will help reduce swelling and ease any discomfort. Think of it like building a fortress to keep the enemy at bay. You may also need to take pain relievers like ibuprofen or acetaminophen to alleviate pain and reduce inflammation after a broken tooth. These medications can be like reinforcements to help you withstand the onslaught and ensure that you're able to fight back. If the broken tooth has sharp edges that are causing irritation or injury to your mouth or tongue, it's essential to cover them up. You can use dental wax or sugarless chewing gum to create a barrier that will prevent further damage and give you time to regroup. But no matter how well you defend yourself, it's always important to see your dentist as soon as possible if you experience a broken tooth. Your dentist can evaluate the damage and determine the best course of treatment. Depending on the severity of the break, your dentist may recommend a filling, crown, or other type of restoration to repair the damage. In some cases, a root canal or tooth extraction may be necessary. Taking action right away can make all the difference when it comes to a broken tooth. Don't hesitate to protect yourself and get the help you need to ensure the best possible outcome. If you've lost a piece of your tooth, or if the break is severe, your dentist may need to take an impression of your tooth to create a custom-made dental crown or veneer. This can help restore the look and function of your tooth while also protecting it from further damage. If you experience a broken tooth, it's important to remember that prompt treatment is key to ensuring the best possible outcome. By taking the above steps and seeing your dentist as soon as possible, you can minimize the risk of further damage and get the care you need to restore your smile. In conclusion, maintaining healthy and strong teeth is essential for good oral health. Consuming vitamins and minerals like vitamin D, vitamin C, vitamin A, calcium, and phosphorus can help build strong teeth and prevent tooth decay. On the other hand, hard and crunchy foods like popcorn and hard candies can be harmful to teeth and cause breakage. If you are prone to breaking teeth, you can avoid such foods or break them into smaller, more manageable pieces before eating. Cooking foods in a way that makes them easier to chew is also helpful. However, if a tooth is broken, it's important to seek dental care as soon as possible to prevent further damage and ensure the best possible outcome. This is it for today and we'll see you in the next video. Thank you for watching.